Press TV's Salman Kujuri is joining me now live from the election headquarters. Let's get the details from him. Salman, over to you. Well, Hama, indeed. Uh, well, the timing of the voting has been extended by two more hours. It means that the voting process will continue at least for uh, until 8 p.m. Tehran local time. Of course, this has been this extension has come as a result of the high turnout of people uh, at the ballot boxes and the polling stations. This is according to the statement released uh, just now by the Interior Ministry. Of course, uh, this extension might once again be renewed, and the timing of the voting will might uh, be extended once again and even uh, twice more uh, because uh, the interior minister has said that until the last voter is uh, at the polling stations and the ballot boxes the vote should be cast and uh, the, the voters should not be prevented from casting their ballots. So we expect that uh, the timing of uh, the, the time of the voting will once again be extended in the future. But so far, according to the statement released by the interior ministry, uh, the voting uh, has been extended until uh, 8 p.m. Tehran local time, Homo. And that's the breaking news for now. Thank you. And someone just quickly before we leave you, we know already that officials have said their turnout has been high. But uh, tell us what more have they said. Has it been higher than was initially expected? Uh, well, in terms of the expectation, this, well, the high turnout of people has so far uh, caught the attention of many uh, reporters and journalists, especially those coming from abroad and from uh, foreign uh, countries and main, main, uh, mainstream uh, media outlets coming from uh, different countries. And uh, this is the, uh, uh, the eye-catching thing about the elections. In terms of the expectation, I believe that, uh, I mean, the interior ministry officials have not yet given us any official uh, uh, figure or uh, number of uh, regarding the percentage of the participation of people. Of course, we have to wait until the end of the voting because if we want to be exact uh, uh, and to be able to make comments regarding the, uh, uh, the high turnout of people, we have to wait until the end of uh, today, the voting, when the voting process comes to an end. Uh, but so far, according to what we have ta been talking to reporters and also journalists who have been covering the election out on the streets and now who are back to the, uh, uh, to the interior ministry, all of them have unanimously said that the turnout of people has been uh, quite uh, much much higher than expected uh, so I believe that this uh, expect this uh, turnout of people at the ballot boxes will continue and uh, to give you a clear idea of what would be the percentage uh, we have to wait until the end of uh, the voting process Hama. okay thank you very much press TV's Salman Kujuri joining us there with the latest from the election headquarters in the interior ministry as, as someone was telling us earlier up until now according to official there's been no major irregularities or problems occurring in polling stations we know as I told you earlier 130,000 ballot boxes being used now across the country in more than uh, or at least 60,000 polling stations and uh, as was just announced there because in 10 minutes time the official time for voting will end but that time has now been extended to two hours so until 8 p.m. up until now we're going to have the voting continue if the turnout is uh, still going up and if people have still not voted that time is going to be extended again